guys to see that this is not clickbait. We've seen naked men, naked women, and like something I've never seen before. Hey alligators, what's up? It's Allie Hardesty and today I am getting ready for a photo shoot I'm about to head over to in like two minutes. This is my ring light right now. I'm just doing my makeup and I'm a freaking mess. I actually haven't slept at all. It's um almost five in the morning and the photo shoot that I'm about to do is three hours away. We're driving to a hot spring and I'm also going with my friend Sarah who lives in my apartment complex. So I'm just quickly trying to look more awake by putting like white eyeshadow and like stuff all over my face. And yeah, I just decided that I would vlog right now because I never vlog and I was like, wait, I've been telling myself and my subscribers that I was going to give it a chance and like make more of an effort to vlog because like, I just don't. I just really, really don't. And I need two more because my life be lit AF. Like, a lot of stuff happens sometimes and I just don't catch it on camera. This is the hardest part about doing my makeup and that is winged eyeliner. So we're going to see if this will be an epic fail or not. Oh, my hair. This is why I do the clip thing. You know, just makes things a lot easier. I just hate when it gets super thick. I feel like I haven't vlogged as much as I could have throughout my YouTube channel career just because I didn't used to ever really watch vlogs or care about vlogs. Like, I would film the thing that I would watch because they would inspire me, you know, like story times and conspiracy theories Like that's what I usually watch on YouTube, but lately I've actually been watching a lot of vlogs So it just makes me want to do it. I didn't even really mean to pull an all-nighter just now I was just up so late watching YouTube and then time got away from me and I was like, oh crap I should probably start getting ready. Hence why I'm in a rush right now The weird faces that people make when they put on mascara You can see the bags under my eyes. This is really annoying me Come back. It's motion censored. I've been trying to make an effort to put lip color on my lips just because they're basically non-existent. I'm doing this thing where I put a bunch of unseen footage into a montage and post it to my Patreon. So I feel like vlogging will be really good for that too because you guys would be surprised how much stuff I actually have to cut out of my videos. Things that are bad or whatever. Just like a different side of myself, honestly. So I'm going to post that kind of stuff onto there. Hey guys, so we've been sleeping in the car a little bit. Oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> it's bad. This is what happens when you don't sleep before the photo shoot and you have four hours to kill in the car. What up? <laughs> <laughs> She's putting an eye drop. Check this out. This looks so, so good. It's really not. Just got to Oregon. Look how pretty this is. We just got to the area we came here for. Check it out, guys. What's up? <laughs> so we're just wearing bikinis underneath these like big sweatshirts and we're about to shoot. He's got big ears. <laughs> oh my god, ears. <laughs> yes. He's super scared of people. Yeah, um, he's getting better. He's warming up to me, right? Hi, cutie. Oh my gosh. This is pretty much his first like outing with people. Hey! Hi. Do the photo shoot. Julio. <laughs> people are naked here. <laughs> it's naked hot spring. We didn't know this. <laughs> Sarah? Hi. What do you guys got to say? Do you have that anything, you have anything to say? Over here relaxing, honestly. Just, uh, it's really nice. It's pretty warm. I would say a little over the warm. <laughs> I want you guys to see that this is not clickbait. There are actual naked bodies, actual naked bodies. everywhere. A lot All of people of are naked. We've seen naked men, naked women. Um, some people are smoking weed. It's very <laughs> chill here. <laughs> Thing like something I've never seen before. Wow! All the white foam, dude. I wish I could swim in it. So Sarah, we just wrapped up our shooting today. Uh, what did you think? I thought that we had some absolutely incredible locations on real visuals. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so it's not like we're on the <laughs> 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 was, But it was that good. Allie? Ditto. <laughs> 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 you just said. Well, Victor? I want to let you guys know where there's smoke, there's usually a fire. And that is what happened today. It's against the law. It was against the law. I want to saw. It was against the law. Shout out to Julio. 
Hey guys, what's up? So it is now the next day. I really hope you guys enjoyed all the footage from yesterday of us in Oregon shooting and doing random stuff. I need to do my laundry right now because all the clothes from yesterday are disgusting. They're covered in sand and whatnot from the hot spring. And some of the clothes that I was wearing were Julio's because I did not come prepared. I didn't pack any sweatpants or anything like that. So I was just wearing a bunch of his clothes. So I want to go ahead and drop those off at his house later today. So the rest of my day pretty much consists of doing online homework broadcasting, I need to post on private snap, just run some errands, maybe clean my house up a little bit and things like that. So this is like sort of a normal day for me on the weekends when I'm just trying to chill out and like get my responsibilities in order. Also, I'm sorry for moving the camera around. I need to get better at that because I always talk with my hands and that's going to be an issue when I don't have the camera on the tripod. I just saw this package outside my door. I'm covering up my real address. <laughs> if you guys want to send things, I do have a PO box, but yeah, it has like this football wrapping. It's kind of weird. We're actually going to open this super quick because I'm really curious to know what it is. It's probably nothing special. I order stuff all the time from Amazon. What is this? It's literally bag chips. Bag, oh, bag clips. I mean, you know the things that like hold the chips together? And then two wall chargers. I forgot I ordered these. And they're the kind where you can put two devices in at once, like if you have an iPad and then your iPhone. I got two of them because I don't like having to carry around a million chargers and this just works a lot better. So yeah, this was exciting. That's what I got. <laughs> Shout out to my mom for sending me these Halloween decorations in the mail. They're super cute. I also have this little guy. This is when I made the Dean's List last semester. My You Now sticker, if you guys watch me on there, it's super cute. I have a little alligator on the head and some mail from you guys. I love getting letters. This is the room where I do my laundry, by the way. It's in there. But we have a ping pong table, a pool table, and a TV with some couches and stuff. So yeah, I honestly never really hang out in here. By the way, since I'm waiting on my laundry, I figured I might as well do a couple life update things. So for one, I officially got accepted to Chico. As you guys probably know, I had been planning on transferring there for a while since I basically started going to the school. So it's officially happening. January should be around the time that I have my new apartment there. I've been calling places, trying to reserve a spot, but it's still really early. So I can't really count on that until it gets a little bit closer. But the apartment that I really want is almost exactly the same as this one. It's through a different apartment complex place over there in Chico, but they look pretty much identical except for they have washers and dryers in the apartment if you choose to like pay for that, which is extra, but it's so worth it. And I really, really, really want that because I hate having to walk across to the main office place where I just showed you guys in the recent clip. I know I'm that lazy. I really don't even like leaving my apartment to do those kind of things. I'm a little bit sad to leave. Actually, I'm a lot sad to leave this apartment. It's my first ever place, but I'm excited to be able to read decorate and everything. This just took me so long to get it to where it is now, how I really, really like it. Like I literally didn't even get a real table until a few months ago. So if you guys have ever seen my apartment tours, my house looks way different since those. I have a couple things that I've been needing to do today, or at least want to do today. And one of those things is figure out my Halloween costume. So I told you guys in a recent video that I'm going to Florida for Halloween to visit a couple friends. And while I'm down there, we're going to Wynwood. I think that's what it's called. Fear Factory, which is the two day festival Was Khalifa will be there, DJ Snake and a bunch of other artists and I'm really excited and so you basically dress up in your Halloween costumes and my friend Kate and I who I'm going to visit we figured that if we did some sort of sexy scary zombie look that would be easy because that way when it's freaking hot and humid and our makeup's coming off it'll look like we did that on purpose. I thought about getting those white contacts that completely white out your eyes but my eyes are super sensitive and I feel like I would just be irritated with them all night and end up taking them out so basically I'm trying to go through my clothes right now and see if I have anything that I could already use. I looked up some inspo pictures online and Honestly, I feel like if I have black lingerie and fishnets or thigh highs and things like that that can sort of rip up, that's going to work, especially because the main part of it is going to be the makeup. So we're just going to go through these boxes right here. This is full of like rave stuff pretty much. And then this is full of lingerie. And I also have some stuff in my closet that I didn't bring out, but I thought I would go through these first. I bought these recently that I wore to a club and they're thigh highs that have the little black bows. Shout out to this company, Rave Cats. They sent me these glasses, which are pretty trippy. See how I look hella crazy? And it came with a case and everything. So if you guys want to check them out, this is not sponsored. They just sent me these. I will put a link in the description. Ooh, this is completely see-through, but I could just wear some like bloody looking pasties. I don't know if they make those, but I could DIY it. And I'll just put 
red paint like all over myself. Ooh, here we go. This is again completely inappropriate and see-through. <laughs> I could wear an entire bodysuit underneath this so the fishnet was just on top, you know what I mean? With thigh highs and I'll just like rip them up and do some damage. So these have been my all-time favorite freaking salads lately. I basically use beans, Parmesan cheese, these lightly salted tortilla strips instead of croutons and then just spinach leaves in a bowl, mix it up. Oh, plus ranch. You cannot forget the ranch. And I was for a while getting fat free ranch but it's freaking disgusting so i started getting light instead shout out to my ac for being super loud but this looks bomb af Hey guys, what's up? Sorry for the messy room. I still have yet to put away my laundry, but I am actually on my way to go do another photo shoot with my good friend Cliffy. I'm here with the one and only Clifton Peaches. <laughs> Don't follow me. I'm like ducking so I don't hit myself. Oh, oh my god, I'm getting you in it. So guys, we are shooting right here and I'm basically wearing all of his clothes now. All of my clothes. It's just improv, you know. Got this hat. <laughs> and then I got this hat and I've been switching it off and look at how dope this place is. I'm making Cody record this because <laughs> I forgot my camera. <laughs> With a camera? I was taking selfies on his that camera. That is so funny. So tell them what just happened. Okay, so this girl on my Snapchat screenshotted my picture in my bikini, and I was like, hey, why'd you screenshot my picture? And she said, because I want to show you to my boyfriend so that we could have a threesome. Are you down? <laughs> and so now we're responding back with a picture of all of us here in the car. <laughs> Saying we're down again. On Saying our way. we're on our way. We're coming <laughs> to her right now. 